Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Right, today we're looking at a new army that I created. Right, I'll show you a couple of the legend attacks. Yeah, this is one of them. Right, as you can see, it's a pretty maxed out base. I think it's just a couple of cannons that ain't maxed. And maxed heroes as well. Right, with this army we're using 9 yetis, 10 bowlers, 3 ice golems. So right, you drop an ice golem and a couple of yetis in each corner to make the funnel. You drop in the siege barracks, the siege barracks have got hog riders in. Drop in the king and the queen. I dropped the 4 earthquake spells to open up the core of the base and then a jump to get into the base. So as you can see, all those troops are going into the middle of the base now. And also, I've got two freeze spells as well, which you need to freeze the scatter shots because they will just kill your bowlers. But this, this strategy is so strong because it's so powerful at the start of the attack. And then obviously, once you've got all your yetis and everything into the core, most of the time you're getting like 90% attacks, 90% two stars, but you can still get the three star attacks even without max heroes as well. And as you can see, this base is completely crushed. You can still, I've still got the Royal champion and some hog riders there as well. The queen as well. And yeah, basically, We've got a couple of cleanup troops, we've got some minions, got a couple of wizards. And yeah, just use the Queen's ability. I'm just waiting for them to clean up the rest of the trash buildings and then that's going to be a triple. So as you can see this army you can even get triples on max bases without maxed heroes so it's a pretty decent attack right i've got one more attack i want to show you as well and that's this one So as you can see, this base is another max base as well. Just uh, a couple of expos, I think, which isn't maxed. But these bases are really bad as well, like the ones with the town hall on the outside of the walls. It's so annoying, especially with this army as well. Well, with the, uh, with the Yeti armies. So just drop the jump down there and then open up the core of this the core of the base with the earthquakes dropping a couple of yetis and an ice golem to start making the funnel and then literally i just smashed everything in that part of the base drop the poison down there That's it, doing the Warns ability. And there you go, getting all the troops inside the middle, using the freezes on the scatter shots.
We've got the hog riders coming up on the right the, on the top there. And from the way how it looked at the start, it looked like this wasn't going to be a triple. But that's like I'm saying, this army is so strong, even at the end of the attack as well. It's all about just getting the funnel created and make sure you're jumping into the right part of the base and making sure that you can get all your troops into the middle. Or like this one, they go around the outside, but the troops that did go into the middle cleared out the splash damage built, um, defenses. I'm just using some clean up troops just to clean out some of the outside buildings as well speed up the attack a little bit but I'm just gonna speed this up a little bit but as you can see it was a triple anyway so yeah that was the army that i wanted to show you like i said i made up that one myself i just took a few different bits from a few different armies and just tested it out and it just seems to be really really strong and there you go, there's another triple. And that's it for today's video. Thank you very much for watching. Please like and subscribe and I'll catch you on the next one. All right, bye.